Welcome back to another Rosso Gold Series release. This is release number 9 and 10. These two coffees, they will be available online throughout December. We'll roast them every Thursday, and ship them out Friday, so you can get the freshest roast possible. I'll be doing two brews for you, one of each, of our Finca Debra Vivid Geisha and our Finca Immaculata Natural CM Sudan Romain. We're going to start with the Finca Debra Vivid Geisha. So for this recipe, we'll actually be using the same recipe for both coffees. The grind is just a little bit coarser on our second brew, the Immaculata. So this is again that medium coarse grind. I have 22 grams of coffee in the brewer here. And we'll start with a bloom of 75. So we're at one minute here. I'm going to do my second pour. And this will go all the way to 250 grams. So again, slow circles, starting from the middle out. So Vivid is the name of the nitrogen anaerobic natural process. Basically, it is a carbonic maceration, but it's done with nitrogen as the tanks are pumped. And then once the coffee is done fermenting, it goes through a natural drying process. So I just finished with the third pour here, all the way up to 375. All right, let's get brewing on the second coffee. Our Finca Immaculata Natural CM Sudan Rume. That CM stands for carbonic maceration, and it's the same idea as our Vivid Geisha, but instead, of nitrogen, it uses carbon dioxide. Now both of these methods, it creates a very creamy texture to the coffee, but it concentrates and increases the intensity of flavor. Now Sudan Rume is a very unique varietal as it's low yield, but the coffee flavor is extremely floral and sometimes it's a bit herbal. So this coffee is more soluble so I've coarsened my grind. So for Finca Immaculata, I was actually able to visit this farm. So the mantra at Immaculata is they want to produce the most exquisite coffee regardless of risks or costs. And I think that's very fitting for this varietal of Sudan Rume because this Sudan Rume, it is a very sturdy tree, but it's very low yielding. So that's why a lot of farms do not plant this varietal. So up first, let's do the Finca Debra Vivid Geisha. Now just from the aroma perspective, this is a very intense cup. I can smell the florals and the sweetness immediately. It's consistent with all of Finca Debra's coffees. I've actually used this coffee in competition, so I have, uh, I have a lot of experience with this coffee. It's incredibly sweet and complex. If you enjoy that classic Panamanian geisha profile, you're going to love this cup. Let's move on to the next one. This is the Finca Immaculata Sudan Rume. So when I was at Origin, this was one of my highest scoring coffees. So let's see how it turned out. Now this coffee is very complex. I think we put Turkish Delight on the bag. There's a rose water or orange blossom floral intensity. I think for most Sudan Rumais, it borderlines on herbal, but this one is just very, very sweet. It's heavy. And I think that's why we put on Turkish Delight. So don't forget guys, you can purchase both of these releases throughout December. The weight is reduced, so you can get it in time for Christmas and you can get a fresh roast. And stay tuned for more exciting releases in 2023. Cheers!